so what is up mga pubs JG Moto here and today we're gonna do a Ducati Monster 636 <laughs> review so guys this is a 2010 Ducati Monster 636 which has a V2 4 stroke engine that produces 78.9 horsepower and 50-ish uh, uh, newton meters of torque so actually I've been I've been riding this motorcycle for a while and uh, well pasarap siyang dalin bukod sa madala siyang tirike well maybe it's because of its age since uh, this one has been made like 10 years ago or 11 years ago but it still it, it still has it I mean put in your punch every time you uh, you uh, on and off the throttle it's very, very smooth the torque very nice and wala ka masabing iba how about let's go for a quick look around So that's it for a quick look around as you can see we're reviewing this now although ang panahon is uh, <laughs> nung weather natin hindi nakikiayon but I truly miss the Basilica wow. so anyway, graduate ako na San Sebastian College so ito yung alma mater ko my school it's been a while since I get here since I visited here so yeah sa mga Sa mga tropa natin mga taga Baste, what's up? <laughs> so it's been a while since we've been here and uh, this is a very nostalgic place. Um, I was thinking about going to Mangray para itry yung uh, Bicol Express but unfortunately it's kind of late and uh, umuulan. <laughs> Nagbabadyang umulan. But I'm truly happy to see the Basilica. Still the same. Sige siya walang masyadong tao. We'll go on the road and let's check the 0 to 60 and 0 to 100 of the Ducati Monster 636 2010. So, guys, what's up? We're back on the road. We're riding the Ducati Monster 696 2010. So, we were talking about earlier, or is the older generation still relevant? Or, like, it's, is, it, is it still. A good choice to buy an older generation of Ducati especially here in the Philippines where the temperature or the weather is mostly hot <laughs> if it's still if it's not raining then it's hot uh, I feel sorry about that kid though you know what in traffic this guy's gonna cook your eggs <laughs> But definitely ergonomics, uh, speed and all that stuff, uh, it's awesome. The ergonomics is uh, upright, a little bit hunched forward, but not too hunched forward to the point that you'll hurt your back. And uh, the controls on the handlebar, it's quite few, simple. Um, we got here like the selections on the min uh, on this digital screen, and then uh, the diagnostic right here. So we're just gonna push down, uh, up. Yeah, there you go. If there's like an error, it's gonna show here. Uh, one more. How do I go back? <laughs> Wait, shut the bike off. So, I think yeah, it's quite hot, but it's uh, it's manageable if you know how to deal with it. So, 
how about we do like a zero to sixty? Na tong bike na to, it's still so good it feels so good to ride that power the power na yun, it was insane <laughs> all smiles all smiles so pumunta tayo biker toys kasi may pipick up in lang ako sa biker toys nasira kasi yung, uh, yung hand guard ni NK so gonna get a replacement for that ang may nickname na nga ito eh Dukatirik <laughs> kasi nga ano medyo medyo natingka siya or hindi siya napaandar for a couple months uh, nung sumaka yung chewing ko sa barko ulit kasi yung chewing ko is uh, seaman so yun medyo matagal siyang uh, syempre wala sa Pilipinas and then sa bahay lang din na to, hindi na papaandar so Ha? Bagong motor, hindi na papaandar Matagal Madaming magiging komplikasyon yan Kakasakit yan Battery, discharge uh, Napalingisan ng gasolina uh, Ng oil At kung ano-ano pa So, nagkalabasan lahat ng sakit niyan Ay, init <laughs> Parang niluluto yung itlog ko <laughs> And one thing also regarding the seat, since like the bike is like shape, yung bike, yung seat ng bike is shape like parang pa down slope or something. So na niya is that na push, na push yung ano mo, yung waist mo para do sumagat ka dun sa may tangke. So sugut hindi mo makita siya pa. So dahil yan. Na ma-experience ma ma experience mo yung tawag ni Sir Zack na IBS. Ano yung IBS? Epit Betlog Syndrome. <laughs> Ang traffic. Giniyado <laughs> mo. Oh, nakadukati pa naman ako dala. Giniyado <laughs> mo. Sunog ang Betlog. <laughs> So yun nga, so nasa review na rin tayo How does this, how does the Ducati Monster fare sa traffic? Kaya, walang problema Ang hindi lang kaya yung init ng makina <laughs> Ayun, no? Ito nyo, nasa 4 na yung temperature ng ano, makina Mainit There you go, basahan daan, daan, daan lang tayo Nani? Mga paps Lagi nating isipin Na bike lane yan mga kapatid Huwag sana natin gawing uh, eh, Pwede nga pala dito Umikot Daanan yung bike lane mga kapatid Ba't dyan Kung baga Kung napanood nyo nga yung content kanina ni Yung video kanina ni Sir Sock Diba? yung about sa tie content kung ang ginagawa mo ay illegal automatic tie ka kung ang ginagawa mo ay hindi illegal then hindi ka tie ha? tama naman si Sir Zach actually yan eh motoblogger ka may ginawa kang illegal then ibig sabihin yung ginawa mong illegal equals tie tapos i-upload mo pa equals content eh di tie content kaya may punto talaga dun si Sir Sack to be honest so 
agree ako doon kay Sersa hindi naman ako nagmamalinis meron mga times talaga na ako mga nagkakamuta rin hindi ko naman may iwas hindi ko naman i-dede na yun kasi tangin na hindi naman tayo ano eh <laughs> matay perfecto <laughs> tayo niya going back to the review uh, how does the Ducati Monster fare sa mga bumps baga yung mga isa suspension niya paano ba na, na hinahandle yung mga malubak na daan ng Metro Manila o ng Pilipinas to be honest ah, maganda yung suspension nito for some reason um, it's not too stiff it's not too soft it's right in the middle I wouldn't say na sobrang ganda na parang adventure bike no, definitely no pero mas maganda suspension nito to most of the motorcycles that I've ridden example, MT-09 uh, yung syempre, NK-400 ko NK-650 uh, Ninja 1000 well, besides Ninja 1000 uh, ma mas maganda yung suspension nito napaka, ano, napaka napaka good hindi tagtag hindi sobrang ano Sobrang solid. Sobrang, yung braking power naman na ito, it has, a, uh, it has a dual caliper, Brembo caliper sa harapan, and a single, uh, a single, uh, syempre, single caliper sa likod, and all of those are Brembo brakes. Pag sinabing Brembo, alam mo na, mamahalin, yayamanin. Pero, syempre, this is a 2010 model, ibig sabihin, wala pang ABS. So, regarding naman sa aesthetics, looks. Alam mo, madami tayong issue dyan eh, sa looks eh. Technically, well, okay. So, yun. So, regarding sa looks, kung bakit ko nasabing madaming issue, meron kasing isang motorcycle brand na ginaya yung itsura ni Ducati Monster. <laughs> From its, uh, yung, yung, as talagang, ano mo, carbon copy ba? <laughs> Pero syempre, meron mga features na hindi nila kayang kopihin, at hindi nila gagawin kopihin. Pero, ayun niya, aesthetics from, from the trellis frame, from, <laughs> kaya, madami nang aasar dito. Pare, rusi ba yan? <laughs> so, sa parang ako maaasar ako, sabi ko, mukha, tunog rusi ba to? Sa tingin mo? <laughs> so what's up mga paps, nandito tayo ulit sa Biker Toys At nabili ko na yung gusto kong bilhin Carbon Lodi Kasi nasira yung, ano, yung, uh, yung handguard nung uh, NK So pinalitan ko lang So yan So as mentioned nga Carbon Lodi <laughs> So as mentioned nandito tayo sa Biker Toys Biker Toys is the one stop shop ng lahat ng CF Moro Moro Motorcycles Mapa NK400, NK650 uh, 650MT Ayan, ito na, may dumating na bago <laughs> Papi, what's up? <laughs> so, ayan nga So, Biker Toys is yung one-stop shop ng lahat ng CF Moro Motorcycles Uh, mapa NK400, NK650, uh, 650MT hanggang CLX700 And also, uh, sin uh, kinocover din nila yung NK150 at 250 However, limited lang yung, ano, limited lang yung, uh, yung stocks ng mga parts ng mga accessories na pwede sa kanila So, meron dito nagpaayos ng NK, NK400 Nagpapalit ng uh, aftermarket na, 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 na levers And then MT09 ni Parin Jeremiah nagpakabit ng battery saka magpapakabit ng uh, bagong ano, panibagong uh, side mirror. So yun nga, so chung, meron ka bang paparating ng mga bagong parts? No, oh, September. Sa September, ano yung mga probably mga paparating ng bagong parts? Ah, uh, marami 'yun basta mga Uh, needs ng uh, set moto MT, uh, GT, at MK Oh, yun So, Pops, uh, and Biker Toys is located at Old Sauyo, Novaliches Search nyo lang sa Google Maps uh, Biker Toys and may kita nyo agad papunta dito Alright? Okay, so 
Kita kita na lang tayo pag ano pag nasa daan na. Ciao. So in summary, I'm gonna give this bike a seven over ten. Because number one, Y7, the power, the looks, uh, the ergonomics, uh, the fun factor. Napaka napaka importante non fun factor na yan. And uh, what more? Yeah, and then. Yung cons is number one, siempre is the uh, siempre old school. Uh, uh, it's uh, it's an old model. Dami naging issue, mahal ang maintenance and uh, oh, mahal ang maintenance and uh, actually yun lang. So if you ask me, would I recommend buying this? No. Would I recommend this to my friends to buy at the Pocket Monster? That is uh, an old model? No. Nani? nice way kasi mali yun eh naka, naka blinker siya tapos naka signal light siya tapos hindi naman siya lumilig ba diba? that might cost uh, accident woohoo I love it I love this bike uh, I'm gonna wrap up my review I'm sorry it's just uh, it's just a very short review with the things that uh, basically basically I'm just uh, sharing my thoughts and impression with this bike uh, and yeah so this bike is this bike is an awesome bike a lot of fun factor you won't get bored but it's a pain in the butt uh, and also it's gonna drain your <laughs> it's it's gonna drain your bank <laughs> Uh, so yeah so my conclusion is that although I rated a 7 over 10 as a bike but as a person if I'm going to recommend this no definitely no I would recommend my friend to get a newer model instead uh, I mean so for for him to be sure that what he's getting is like worth it it's either you buy a brand new one or buy a second hand that is uh, a bit newer a bit a bit newer like 2000 maybe 2015 16 17 18 something like that so yeah so guys make sure that you are subscribed to my video and also if you can hit the like button and share the video I would truly appreciate it and thank you very much guys for uh, for your support and for watching the video and I hope you guys will have an awesome Saturday thank you very much again and ciao see you soon